We're back today with super easy meal prep that won't break the budget. Sheet pan chicken fajitas. This one is packed with protein. Shocking, I know. It can be used a variety of ways so you never get bored. It takes 10 minutes or less to prep. So let's jump right into it. Question of the day, corn or flour tortillas? Drop it in the comments below. Start this one by taking out a large mixing bowl. The first thing we're gonna add into it is two pounds of fat trimmed chicken cut up into strips. I usually make them around this size. I'm using chicken breasts today, but the thighs are just as good. They're almost always cheaper. You've never had chicken thighs before, the end result with using them is more tender. Add your chicken into your mixing bowl, followed by your choice of chopped up fajita vegetables. I went with an assortment of bell peppers, green, yellow, red, and orange. Next, half a red onion, and I usually like mushrooms with this one too, but I didn't use them today. Continue with a tablespoon of chili powder, one and a half teaspoons of smoked paprika, three fourths a teaspoon of garlic powder, three fourths a teaspoon of onion powder, one teaspoon of oregano, three fourths a teaspoon of ground cumin, one teaspoon of black pepper, and a little optional salt. Now, if you wanna make this step easier, or you don't wanna buy everything here, you could use eight teaspoons of some taco seasoning mix. Remember that I always include the exact weight for every ingredient I use for every recipe in both US and metric conversions on the website, which is linked up here or below in the description. Moving on, you'll need one ounce of a low sodium soy sauce, one ounce of lime juice, and two tablespoons of some olive oil. Give all those a thorough mix. Using your hands might make this step easier. Alternatively, you can also mix this in a sealable bag, which will give you the quick option to let it marinate for a bit. Now from here, take out an optionally lined baking sheet or oven safe dish. The size you use will be dependent on how much you want to meal prep. I'm using a half sheet today, but you could use a full baking sheet like this for a longer meal prep. Coat your pan or dish with a little cooking spray or olive oil and pour in your mix. Do your best to evenly distribute it across your pan or dish, then throw it in the oven on 400 for around 40 minutes. I do my best to flip everything around after 20 to 25 minutes. In the end, it should look like this. tips for this one. Number one, if you're not eating it with tortillas, you can eat it by itself or make chicken fajita bowls with rice, quinoa, and so on. Number two, add in another protein source like shrimp. Number three, another great substitute for some of the ingredients here is tahini. I'll put how to incorporate this on the website. And number four, my preferred methods for reheating this one, either a quick 30 to 45 second zap in the microwave or the air fryer for five to 10 minutes. All right, the winner of our last testing your guesstimating was, bang, you win a shaker a shirt. For this week's testing your guesstimating, we're gonna go with this single uncooked chicken breast. What do you think it weighs in grams? One guess per person in the comments below, and the closest to it wins a shaker or shirt. With that said, thank you all for watching. Hit that thumbs up button for more meal prep ideas. Subscribe if you haven't already, so you never miss a video. Don't forget to check out theproteinchef.co for all your healthy recipe needs, and of course, stay healthy.